Hi, so today we're going to be taking apart a uh, Volkswagen Passat. I think it's a 2000. It's got a 1.8 turbo and a 5 speed manual. Uh, don't really care too, too much for the car, but I like the engine and transmission, and we'll be using it in the rear end for a mid engine rear wheel drive uh, semi open wheel street race car. So let's get to it. So, first thing I'm going to get to is I'm going to remove the hood. Uh, this part of the shop's really dark. I don't want to be banging my head. And I have no use for the rest of this car. So, take it to the bin and have it out of my hair. You have to appreciate some of the lengths that the engineers go to. From those pointed bolts to make assembly and installation easier to you know, two different interfaces. But on top of that, the fact that it has that kind of pocket in the middle just makes it that much lighter. So whether that was their intent or just a side effect of manufacturing requirements, I really, <laughs> I love seeing that stuff. It just makes me smile. Um, 
The transmission linkage, I think, is a pain. Uh, I think that involves interior work, which isn't the end of the world. I've done it before, but it's still annoying. Although I can probably do it here on the bottom side, rear engine side. Who knows? Anyway, there's a lot of lines, a lot of things going everywhere. Um, it's going to be a ton of fun to try and implement this into a small package. That's our cut. member that supports the radiator, AC, condenser, or not condenser, but the heat exchanger, whatever, and a front end ancillary items, whatever. It's also an intercooler pipe. So they've doubled up on the utility. Beautiful, excellent design. Go. A plus. <laughs> Nathan, oh, uh, he's helping me right now. I think the next thing we have to do is lift the car up, um, take the wheels off, take the drive shafts off, take the exhaust off, see how the trans is held on, remove the shifter linkage, and then yank it out. is this Volkswagen fuck off with the boutique ass tools Jesus uh, where are we at Nathan well we undid the mounts transmission mounts engine mounts we're pretty sure everything's undone for electrical and hoses and all that kind of stuff uh, you're great with the hose <laughs> <laughs> well uh, at this point it looks like we're just gonna try and lift it and then go from there. Yeah, I guess we'll just lift it up, see what happens. Oh yeah, the legs.